This is the RS4 chassis I did for a customer. Carbon fiber. I had to redesign it. And that's what I came up with. Still got some cleaning up to do on it. Alright, here's the RS4 I just did the chassis for. For a customer of mine. Made this top piece he had out made it out of aluminum. So I remade that for him. Yeah, got one of my motor mounts a while back. So it's a lot all way side to side. Battery tray, I just gotta do the cutouts for the battery. And then the other side. You see in the back. So it ain't got no flex, it don't bend in. And I added for the screws right there, the little hole for the set screws on the front and back. Cause I don't know why HPI didn't put it on there, but I added those on there for him so he can uh, use the set screws right there for the suspension to set it down low. All right, thanks. So little oven right here, my boy Kenny made. Picture of the Predator's daughter drew for me. That's the heated element. Little glass. Let me open it up. Just the oven for powder coating. Got the little pole at the top to hang stuff. I've been powder coating with a little toast oven. Can't fit nothing in it. So now I can do my fifth scale chassis or whatever I want to do. I can do car parts if I want to. And I got another package that came today. This big old crate. My meal. Been waiting for. Couple of things I'm working on. Big heat sack ordered. Carbon fiber. Three K. Two sheets. Just three mil right here. The one that's taped up already is four. It's all made in America, not from China, so it's real, real strong. I don't want nothing failing on me or somebody if I make something for them. Here it is out the box. And then I got all the motors and everything to make it CNC. Some mini mill. <laughs> 